Welcome to Miracles in Motion, the channel where I share with you Zen wisdom stories that will inspire and motivate you to live your best life. Today, I'm going to tell you a story about the five ways to boost your self-esteem. Self-esteem is the confidence and respect you have for yourself. It affects how you think, feel, and act in different situations. Having a healthy self-esteem can help you achieve your goals, overcome challenges, and enjoy life more. But sometimes, we may struggle with low self-esteem which can make us feel insecure, unhappy, and unworthy. How can we overcome this negative state of mind and cultivate a positive self-image? Here are five Zen tips that can help you boost your self-esteem. 1. Be mindful of your thoughts. Your thoughts have a powerful influence on your self-esteem. If you constantly think negatively about yourself, you will feel bad and act accordingly. But if you practice mindfulness, you can become aware of your thoughts and choose to focus on the ones that are helpful and supportive. Mindfulness is the art of paying attention to the present moment, without judgment or attachment. It helps you to accept yourself as you are, and to recognize your strengths and abilities. You can practice mindfulness by meditating, breathing deeply, or simply observing your surroundings with curiosity and appreciation. 2. Be compassionate to yourself. Sometimes, we are our own worst critics. We judge ourselves harshly, compare ourselves to others, and blame ourselves for our mistakes. This can erode our self-esteem and make us feel unworthy of love and happiness. But if we practice compassion, we can treat ourselves with kindness and understanding. Compassion is the feeling of empathy and care for oneself and others who are suffering. It helps you to forgive yourself, to learn from your failures, and to celebrate your successes. You can practice compassion by speaking to yourself as you would to a friend, by acknowledging your feelings without shame or guilt, or by doing something that makes you happy. 3. Be grateful for what you have. Sometimes, we take for granted the things that we have in our lives, and we focus on what we lack or want. This can make us feel dissatisfied and unhappy with ourselves and our situation. But if we practice gratitude, we can appreciate the things that we have and the opportunities that we get. Gratitude is the feeling of thankfulness and appreciation for the good things in life. It helps you to recognize your value and worth, and to be optimistic about the future. You can practice gratitude by writing down three things that you are grateful for every day, by expressing your gratitude to others who have helped you, or by giving back to your community. 4. Be authentic to yourself. Sometimes, we try to fit in with others or follow their expectations, and we lose sight of who we are and what we want. This can make us feel unhappy and unfulfilled with ourselves and our lives. But if we practice authenticity, we can be true to ourselves and express our uniqueness. Authenticity is the quality of being honest and genuine with oneself and others. It helps you to discover your passions and values, and to pursue your dreams and goals. You can practice authenticity by listening to your intuition, by speaking your mind respectfully, or by doing something that reflects your personality. 5. Be courageous in your actions. Sometimes, we let fear stop us from doing the things that we want or need to do. We avoid challenges, risks, or changes that could help us grow and improve ourselves. This can make us feel stuck and powerless in our lives. But if we practice courage, we can overcome our fears and take action despite them. Courage is the ability to face danger or difficulty with confidence and determination. It helps you to expand your comfort zone, to learn new skills and experiences, and to achieve your potential. You can practice courage by setting realistic goals for yourself, by facing your fears one step at a time, or by asking for help when you need it. These are the five ways to boost your self-esteem according to Zen wisdom, be mindful of your thoughts, be compassionate to yourself, be grateful for what you have, be authentic to yourself, and be courageous in your actions. I hope this story has inspired you to improve your self-esteem and live a happier life. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel for more Zen wisdom stories like this one. Also, please leave a comment below telling me what you think about this story or sharing your own tips on how to boost your self-esteem. And don't forget to like this video and share it with your friends who might benefit from it. Thank you for watching Miracles in Motion.